Biologist Jonathan Ledden's office is his pickup truck, in which he carries the tools of his trade, binoculars, hawk traps, and an assortment of firearms. He uses these to deal with bird or mammal activity around the runways and the approach and departure corridors of the BWI airport. Uh, it can vary. It depends, you know, what we're dealing with that day. Some days, you know, more interesting than, than others. Uh, and then uh, one thing I like about our job is, you know, it varies seasonally. So, I mean, we're not doing the same thing all the time. We really got to focus our airport, our efforts and our resources to what is a hazard at that time. That's an American Kestrel that is flying right there. It's morning doves, that was a singular morning dove. Its risk is dramatically decreased at this time of year if they're, if they're singular. If they're in a flock together, though, obviously you have a potential for um, multiple wildlife strike and um, possibility for them to do more damage. These being where we're at, safety concerns, I'm, I'm not going to shoot a pyrotechnic at them. Um, I'll try the horn if it doesn't work. I'll try to push them to an area. I'll get out of the truck and try to push them to an area where we could either shoot pyrotechnics or, or use the horn more effectively. Yeah. So. I knew they were going to stay there. So. so this is a Swedish goshawk <laughs> trap. And uh, the way it works is the birds on the bottom are decoy protected by the cage wire here. And uh, the hawk either circling or, or coming out will see the, see the birds. And when they come here, most often a, a bird will come and he'll perch on this board. When he does, it'll shut these doors. And they'll come close and then the bird will be unharmed in here. As you can see, we use this netting so it's real soft as it comes down on the bird. We fan them and we relocate them. We're trying to keep water access like this covered up. We, if it was open, we'd have a lot more problems with herons and egrets and uh, waterfowl species coming in. So that's why the vegetation is always focused around these. For birds not deterred by habitat modification, Ledden has a pallet of noisemakers like propane cannons at the ready. Some morning doves over here that have that come off the ground and gotten these trees. We're going to use a pyrotechnic to harass them. We're hoping to push them that way that's why we'll we'll shoot it in a direction that the sound hopefully pushes them that way so there's two types of pyrotechnics that we use uh, the red right here is a it's called a banger it sounds like a loud explosion and then the yellow is a screamer which is a really high pitched noise that'll that'll last longer and and move as the bird moves as well they're fired by a uh, pyrotechnic cat pistol which shoots 22 blanks that propel them in the air and ignite the powder 